Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. So guys, you asked me to make a video on a method to get the dynamic island on all devices with a jailbreak. So this video is for you. The method shown in this video is completely free. As you can see, I am on this iOS 16 device. I am already jailbroken with the dopamine. So any jailbreak like pale rain rootless, dopamine rootless should work. After you are jailbroken, open Celio. You can see the version here now to install it go to sources and simply add this source e t h x n n 88 dot github dot io slash repo to add it you can simply hit this add button simply type it here and then hit add source also to make it work add allocate dot space repo also and make sure you install allocate from here also go to search and search for preference loader and install it as well now simply open this source go to all categories and you will find this visible island open it and you can see it is completely free you can simply hit get cute and confirm to install it then restart springboard once you're back Open settings, scroll all the way down and you'll find visible island here. Open it and now you can enable dynamic island from here. You can also change its position if you want to lower it a bit. You can have the option to hide it when it is not in use and you can also disable island outline. You can configure notifications. So to fix notification positioning, you can also use custom notification position right here with the x and y values you can also change the color and opacity from here and you can also change the dynamic island scale so that you can make it bigger or smaller all right so once everything is set and you enable it now simply hit this respring and then hit respring again and you can see after the respring the dynamic island is working on my device just fine you can see i am using screen mirroring so it is being shown here now we will also test it with the timer i will search for it and set it here and it works fine all right and the timer is working fine without any problem here now towards the end of the video if you see your dynamic island is hiding some aspects of your screen or it is covering something what you can do is open the visible islands settings and use the y position or x position to position it to your liking according to your device that's all for this video guys if you still have questions please ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care